Today, we will talk about the Fama and French three-factor model. The Fama and French three-factor model is an asset pricing model that expands on the capital asset pricing model by adding size risk and value risk factors to the market risk factor in CAPM. This model considers the fact that value and small cap stocks outperform markets on a regular basis. By including these two additional factors, the model adjusts for this outperforming tendency, which is thought to make it a better tool for evaluating manager performance. The Fama and French model has three factors, the size of firms, book-to-market values, and excess return on the market. In other words, the three factors used are small minus big, high minus low, HML, and the portfolio's return less the risk-free rate of return. SMB accounts for publicly traded companies with small market caps that generate higher returns, while HML accounts for value stocks with high book-to-market ratios that generate higher returns in comparison to the market. Researchers have expanded the three-factor model in recent years to include other factors, such as momentum, quality, and low volatility, and in 2014, Fama and French adapted their model to include five factors. Along with the original three factors, the new model adds the concept that companies reporting higher future earnings have higher returns in the stock market, a factor known as profitability. Fama and French highlighted that investors must be able to ride out the extra volatility and periodic underperformance that could occur in the short term. Investors with a long-term time horizon of 15 years or more will be rewarded for losses suffered in the short term. Given that the model could explain as much as 95% of the return in a diversified stock portfolio, investors can tailor their portfolios to receive an average expected return according to the relative risks they assume. The Fama and French model has three factors, the size of firms, book-to-market values, and excess return on the market. In other words, the three factors used are SMB, HML, high-low, and the portfolio's return less the risk-free rate of return. SMB accounts for publicly traded companies with small market caps that generate higher returns, while HML accounts for value stocks with high book-to-market ratios that generate higher returns in comparison to the market. Fama and French adapted their model to include five factors, adding profitability and investment to the original three factors. The new model adds the concept that companies reporting higher future earnings have higher returns in the stock market, and also considers the concept of internal investment and returns. Here are three key takeaways. 1. The Fama French three-factor model expands the CAPM by adding size risk and value risk factors to the market risk factors. 2. The model was developed by Nobel laureates Eugene Fama and his colleague Kenneth French in the 1990s. 3. The model is essentially the result of an econometric regression of historical stock prices. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.